All right, we're gonna solve this problem. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move one of these radical terms to the right, so I'm gonna have 3x plus seven is equal to one, minus the square root of x plus two, square both sides. I'm gonna end up with 3x plus seven is equal to one minus two root x plus two plus x plus two, because it just cancels itself out. Or I uh, get rid of the radical. All right, so um, move the x terms over. Minus two, well x and then the constants, so minus x, and then this is minus three. So I get two x plus four is equal to um, negative two, square root of x plus two, square both sides. I end up with four x squared plus 16x plus 16 is equal to 4 quantity x plus 2. So the 4s can cancel out. So we're left with x squared plus 4x plus 4 equals x plus 2. Minus x minus 2 minus x minus 2. So moving this over here, so I get x squared plus 3x plus 2 um, is equal to 0. This factors down to x plus 1, x plus 2 um, is equal to 0. x equals negative 1, negative 2. I'm not done yet though. I gotta check and make sure these work. So for the first part, negative 1, so negative 3, so that's 4. So that ends up being square root of 4 is 2 plus 1 so that does not work negative 1 does not work um, what about negative 2? negative 2 so that ends up being 1 yeah negative 2 does work so x is equal to negative 2 even though we ended up getting negative 1 as a result um, it doesn't check out Okay, that's it. Negative two's the solution.